An election recount is on in Wisconsin, and recounts appear to be moving forward in the two other states that broke Democrats' hearts on Election Day, Pennsylvania and Michigan, which was officially called for Trump this afternoon. More than $6 million has poured in to cover the manual vote counts, in the form of donations to Green Party candidate Jill Stein, who's spearheading the effort. Stein definitely won't find enough votes to win, but she says that isn't why she launched the effort. Evan McMorris-Santoro explains. There's one thing election observers, top Democrats, and Donald Trump all agree on. Jill Stein's recounts won't change the results of the general election. They all say Donald Trump is still going to be president. But claims that election law was violated are now everywhere. Donald Trump directly alleged that millions of voters cast their votes illegally, and Jill Stein's giving credibility to the theory that election machines were hacked. The Clinton campaign is giving tacit support to Jill Stein. Claims of widespread voter fraud and election hacking are pretty common to elections, but they've never been proven. So now we're living inside two separate conspiracy theories, both of which question the very integrity of American democracy. If nothing else, this is going to give us a very good audit. It's going to reassure Wisconsin voters that we have a fair system. Wisconsin officials agreed today to go ahead with Jill Stein's recount. It should start Thursday and be done by December 13th. Pennsylvania officials need paperwork filed today, and Stein's team says they're going to have people on the ground filing a recount in Michigan, too. The Clinton campaign is at the same time both for and against these recounts. An official told us, we're not initiating recounts, but we're going to participate in those initiated by others. They're going to send out lawyers to monitor the process. But they're also trying really hard to make sure that no one thinks it's their process. We are not assisting the Green Party in any way, the official told us. We don't support the idea of recounts. We don't even support the push for recounts. The Green Party told us that the recounts are a, quote, stein Baraka campaign project, unquote. So we talked to Jill Stein about why she's insisting on recounts and what she's going to do with all the money that she raised. Belatedly, the Clinton campaign decided that they were going to approve it. I don't think they're going to be actively involved. We are not coordinating with them. Uh, we are not planning with them. Our lawyers have talked to each other to make sure they don't get in each other's way and to know what they intend to do. Um, I think, you know, this is a nonpartisan issue. It's not about the candidates. It's not about helping one or hurting another. If there is funds left over, which we do not expect, uh, if in the event that turned out to be the case, we would be following FEC rules about what exactly should be done with that money.